Hi everybody, my name is Casey. I work at the Valor Village Library. I'm here today with a friction experiment that you can try with your kids at home. This is an experiment that I actually did in grade six in school, but you can definitely do it with younger kids as well, so don't worry too much about that. Um, the experiment is to pick a bunch of materials. Um, you can have your kids help you pick these materials. We'll get to that later. Um, they're going to guess which ones have more friction and which ones have less friction and then you're going to run the experiment to see if they're right or not. So what is friction? Friction is the force that makes things that are sliding or rolling across the surface slow down. So more friction means they slow down more quickly and less friction means they keep going for quite a while. So in order to test friction on surfaces we're going to use something that rolls. Um, use a cylinder rather than a ball just so that it only rolls in one direction, it's easier to run your experiment. I'm going to use an aluminum can for my experiment. Uh, you can use a lot of empty food containers for this, so it's not too hard to find something to use. You're going to need a ramp for your rolling device. I made a ramp out of mega blocks and a book. Very fancy, right? Just like that. Oops. It settles. <laughs> um, my one tip for making a ramp is make it more of a shallow ramp, not a very steep one. If you use a steep one, then your rolling device is going to just fly off too far. You're not going to be able to really measure how far it went. Um, keep it to something that makes it roll a reasonable distance on a smooth surface so that when you're on the rougher surfaces, it'll definitely go reasonable distance because that's the trick. Smoother surfaces with less friction, your can will roll further. On rougher surfaces with more friction, It'll roll not as far. All right. Now, the, one of the more fun parts of this experiment is picking the materials. So again, I would say let your kids be involved in that. They'll probably be more creative than you are anyway. But I'm here to give you some ideas anyway. So here are some ideas. My favorite soft, fluffy towel. This old, really scratchy towel. Why do we have this? Sequins! A yoga mat. And I would love to see the materials that you come up with to test with your very simple friction experiment. Um, if you do try this experiment at home, or if you're trying any of our other activities or resources, um, please do let us know about it. You can use the hashtag VPL at home. That's V-P-L-A-T-H-O-M-E, not the at symbol. Um, we'd love to see what you're doing at home, of course. As I always say, we do miss you during this closure. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.